Hey there, I'm Billy Decker. Welcome back to module number three in the Billy Decker bus glue series explanation how the hell do these things work. In number three, we're going to talk about the electric guitars. Now, one of the coolest things about my electric guitar bus glue series is it's basically a set it and forget it program. It works on clean guitars, works on dirty guitars, it works on cigar box guitars, it works on guitars you've stolen from best friends, it works on guitars that you bought at a pawn shop. Let me show you what this sounds like without it. Let's find a good example of a chuggy guitar right here. All right, that's a nice chugging guitar. Let's put the bus glue electric on and we calibrate our knobs. Our mix is at 10. I've got a stereo patch. I copy it over. That's done. It's that easy. Now let's put it on a distorted heavy guitar in a chorus. See what that sounds like. Here's without. All right, let's pop it on does not get any easier than this. Let's put that guy right around the 30 mark. Turn up that bad boy. Let's clone it over. All right, now let's pop it over. Let's just clone this to a few other tracks. And what do we got going on here? Let's just clone it over. What's this? Ah, uh, let's just pop another one on there. Oh, don't you wish every day was as easy as this when you're mixing a song? Well, it can be. And I'm showing you exactly how it can be. All right, let's hit play. Let's open up this song. What do we got? Drums, bass. Uh, drums and acoustic and guitars so far. We have not done bass. We're doing that in the next module. So we'll leave that out, but we will open up our acoustics we did with our drums and let's see what we got. So there you have it, the electric Billy Decker bus glue. We'll see you on the charts.